If you're like me, you love using visuals to tell a story. Infographics are a fantastic way to do that. In this video, we'll cover what an infographic is, how to make them dynamic and engaging, all within PowerPoint. So what exactly is an infographic? Simply put, it's a visual representation of information or data. Infographics are designed to make complex information easy to understand. They're used in education, marketing, journalism, and business to communicate data clearly and effectively. Most often they are created and presented using PowerPoint. Think of an infographic as a visual story that makes data come to life. Whether you're presenting in a classroom, boardroom, or sharing on social media, infographics can capture your audience's attention and make your message memorable. If you're looking for inspiration or examples of infographics, there are several great resources. Google Images is a quick and easy place to start. Another is Adobe Stock, also Canva, and Infogram are also excellent resources for both examples and templates. When looking for examples of infographics, one of the best places to look at various types of infographics is PowerPoint. If you open PowerPoint and go to Insert, located together are the two best locations for infographics, SmartArt and Charts. Click on SmartArt and the Choose a SmartArt graphic window appears. On the left is a list of various types of graphics. Process, Cycle, Hierarchy, Relationship, Matrix, Pyramid, Picture, and Office.com. What is great is on the right, it tells you the proper use of each graphic. For example, if we select Chevron, it says Chevron Access Process and how to use it. Move up to the ribbon and select Chart. The Insert Chart opens. Once again, we have a list of the types of charts. Most common are Line, Pie, and Bar. But we have a lot of other options. What is a dynamic infographic in a PowerPoint presentation? Dynamic infographics are not static, but interactive, such as animation, audio, video, pop-up windows, and hover over labels. Today, we're gonna to build an infographic about five benefits of planting trees using a simple morph transition. This page shows all the things you need in an infographic. Every infographic should tell a story. Here, the presenter will use each of these icons to tell a story. The title and headings should be clear and to the point. Five benefits of planting trees. Include data in the form of statistics that support the story. Our title is from five facts about the benefits of planting trees. The design should use bold, appropriate colors that don't obscure the text or images. Each part of the infographic should be understandable in two to five seconds. We have five round circles which contain both our bold type descriptions and the story graphics. Our final infographic is simple and easy to understand. For our presentation, we'll start with a tree with circles that are numbered one through five. We then talk about each of the five benefits of planting trees. Number one, combat climate change. Number two, provide shade and shelter. Number three, clean the air. Number four, prevent flooding. And our last slide is still a morph transition, but done in a different way. And that's number five, improve mental health. 